Hello everyone and welcome back. If you are new here, please subscribe to my channel and uh, let's get started. Uh, I was looking online for a very long, very long time to get a Sloven Sheer Deluxe for my Weber kettle. And uh, looks like I found a good deal. It finally dropped in price. In uh, I bought it from Amazon for $89. It came out uh, really fast with free shipping. So uh, we're gonna do an unboxing today. Let's see what's in the box. As you can see, I already tear the box apart. So uh, when you open, you got this bubble wrap. You got these little SNS grills. Two zones are better than one. It's a little magnet. I guess it's uh, it sticks down. My tape is a magnet. I mean, it's a uh, metal. Okay. We get that, we get the little booklet, I guess. Let's see what's in here. With the, uh, I guess, uh, methods of cooking. Ooh, look at that steak. All right, what else is here? We got a little uh, sticker. Stick it on your, on your grill or uh, on your car. Bam, right there. And, uh, let's see, we got the water pan right here. Let's see if I can uh, open it with one hand. Alright, one sec. Okay, it's right here. Water pan, got some little scratches, but that's fine. You can see me there. Looks uh, high build quality, it's like super heavy and premium quality. Let me put this down. And over here we got the big boy. Let's, uh, let's see. One second, I'm opening the bag. Get the box down, right here, this is the bad boy right here, looks like it's, uh, looks very very nicely built, very heavy, there's no welds in here so it should last forever, it looks much better in person and much bigger in person than uh, that's actually in the pictures, very nice, got a little, a little plastic wrap over there for something, uh, burn it in. Um, let's install this water pan as well and see. Yes, it goes in like that. Perfect. Right there. A little play on the water pan, but I guess that's normal. Perfect. All right. And so uh, let's give it a try. My grill right here. I'm using the Weber 7 years anniversary edition. I gotta clean it up a little bit. All right. Gonna take this. Nice. All right. There we go. It's, it's perfect right there. If it, if it's right under those uh, clips where the great sit, right there is how you want tilt. I guess I never seen this before, but yeah, see right there. That's how it looks so far. Alright, I hope this uh, is gonna work much better than the Weber baskets. It's good, I'm gonna cook everything here for the direct side and I'm gonna move it over on the indirect side just like that. Alright, let's uh, take one more look at it. Perfect, so now I'm using lamp charcoal so this little bottom grate is gonna keep it all in place. And uh, once I'm done, I'm gonna reuse it and just shake it like this and uh, <coughs> reuse it. I like it that it goes right right under the clip right there. Perfect. Yep. Alright, let me get the, the chimney ready and uh, we're also gonna do a first cook. So uh, let's see how this performs. Alright, stay tuned. Perfect, as you can see I'm using lump charcoal. What I want to show you is this right here. I'm gonna put this up at the wall right here, I just didn't have enough time. My brother-in-law made this uh, for me, it's custom made for my channel. My YouTube channel right here. It's also matching, that's me right there, but I'm a little bit fatter than that. It's all good. And uh, it's also matching my Weber right here, as you can see. You got the idea. It's very nice quality, look at this shiny. For now, it just sits here. I'm gonna take care of it this week. All right, I'm waiting for the fire to get up to temperature and, um, and then I'm gonna cook something. Stay tuned. All right, this is what's going on the grill after the charcoal is ready. 
I have some baby potatoes over here with a little bit of oil and some uh, spices. <clears throat> and over here I have the skirt steak. I uh, took it and uh, I put this cheese and uh, spinach and then I just roll it and cut it in half and I put a little twine around so it will sit to stay together. I'm gonna cook this indirect and uh, I'm gonna cook that direct. Or it's gonna be a good dinner. Oui. It's been barely not even 10 minutes, so I'm gonna put the, this uh, Weber chimney is very efficient with lamp charcoal. All right, let's see. Oh, look at that. That's perfect right there. Oh, way perfect. God damn. Well, I'm gonna let this burn in for uh, 10, 15 minutes, so it's gonna have a nice burn, and then we're gonna start grilling. It's been just one minute. I just put the grates in. That's how it looks with the grates right there. Perfect, it's almost, uh, I would say almost half of the space is direct and half is indirect. Actually got a little bit more indirect. Well, let's put the lid on and uh, see how the temperature rises. Let's see that. This is on the indirect side, so probably it's gonna take a while. I'll be right back. Time to put the lid down and just see how the temperature does. Now, it's raising very fast. 400, 450. Now we can really see our steak. 500. Still going fast. It's five, uh, 550 so far. Still coming up to temperature. Oh yeah, it's good. All right, let's take a look now. Beautiful, beautiful. All right. I guess uh, I cleaned the grates and everything's ready to put the put the meat on. I'm gonna do this in the rig. So, uh, take one by one, look at that. Ooh. Let's see, I'm gonna do one right here. Bam, right there. And one right here. Bam, right there. Beautiful, beautiful. All right. And uh, I'm gonna put the potatoes in. It's my favorite, my favorite side dish right here. Just like that. Perfect. Now we're cooking. Yeah, boy. Well, I'll be back in a couple of minutes and uh, give you an update. That's around 20 minutes in so far. My rolls are looking good. Corn looking good. Look at that. Potatoes looking amazing too. Alright, almost done. I'm gonna uh, probe this and see how much longer. Alright. Looking very good. Look at that. Perfect right there. This one's a little bit more. I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to rotate this so it gets nice and uh, crisp on all the sides. Like that. Perfect. Let me get the poke. 
got my uh, fast temperature uh, reader over here. It's uh, 84, uh, in between 80 and 90 actually. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna cook this uh, till it's gonna reach 135. But yeah, so far looking very good. It reached 120 degrees. Got uh, 15 more degrees to go. But that's how everything looks so far. Look at my charger right there. Can't wait to carve into this. Well, it looks like it reached 100, uh, around 130 degrees. Look at this, how nice it melted down. In case this is the spinach. It's very nice, like a little explosion. Like a volcano. Look at this. Ooh. Right there, that's one. Look at the juice is coming off. Perfect, I'm gonna let this rest for 10 minutes, then I'm gonna slice it in half and uh, see how we did. All right. All right, it's been only five minutes, I can't wait no more, I'm hungry. But uh, I'm gonna slice this half in half like that. Let's see what we got. Oof, look at that. Absolutely perfect. Let me cut this other one as well. Look at that, guys. Perfect right there. Slowest here is doing a very good job. So, so far, so good. Well, I'm gonna, I guess I'm going to give you an update two weeks later and um, I'm going to use it every day. But uh, thanks for watching and please subscribe and uh, hit that notification button. Thank you.